Hello, YouTube again. This is Gustavo146, and, uh, what's my name again? I was knocked off by the barbecue and even under this way weighty bowl. Please get rid of it. I can hardly breathe. This is Slick Alipay, just so you all know. Oh, yeah, no. You can't break that rock. Yet. So, here is the rest of our beta feature playthrough of Bottles Revenge. In this episode, we're mainly going to defeat the first boss and show you the basics of the game and the Bottles Revenge beta feature, which we will should be going through the entire game with, hopefully. Okay? So stop crying. I'm just kidding. I wasn't kidding. Could we just like climb over the mountain? And let's go find an enemy to give them an example. And here's what the bottle of revenge is for. He can possess enemies and try to possess attack enemies and try to attack your friend with the second control. This mode is only accessible through cheat devices. So if you have Game Shark for your Nintendo 64 and you find the code, then it will work. I think. Yeah, it should work. I'm not really sure how Game Shark works, but I know that we're using. And those we're, we're using a game. We're using a ROM. We're using a game. We're using Game Shark code. So I forgot how to switch. You press the R button. You press the R button to change into another enemy, but. It looks like it's not working for some reason, so... We might have to play this <laughs> And here's this guy, he's just telling us... Oh, dude, I hate that guy. Oh, that's such a nice and... and you can't run... This, these enemies can't run nearly as fast as And this is what... Which is very... It's just kind of funny. You can break these boxes just by using the little pick thing. Hey, can he break up and bounce his if he can? Nope. So you can't open up boxes. Which I just noticed say right on them. And of course, the player one ventures too far away and decides to get pussy. And red feathers are flying with each roll, and we are going to climb. Red, red, uh, red feathers, most of the time, which swap between colors, so you can get gold feathers, which make you invincible. You can also just climb up the bridge if you want to take a quick short, quick short cut. And you can also get into Gwenti's old player, not her player. And there's a gray over there, but we'll get into that later. Later is. As you can see, this is a half down place. Oh, well, you can go into the game. I didn't do that. We'll probably just explore this later. Okay, because I have no idea what that is. I'll probably go home tonight and take a look at it. Swimming controls are relatively easy. But you don't stay underwater if you like jump down there, which I find it. And instead of blue honeycombs, it's bubbles, uh -huh. which is cool with this. The sequels are always better sometimes. We'll swap off every other episode. And those get the shot. We're gonna be switching off every other world, except we didn't switch off this time. Because I'm well, here's a little beta. Here's a little sign of beta. -ness. You can totally just walk around underwater with that creature. Normally, see things when they're going to fall. Rare, Rare was going to release this, but never had. Yeah, so if you got, if, if there are fanboys from this game that are just like really horny right now because they just found out that there's a player two mode for this. For adventure mode, well, you know, kind of calm down because you can only do this with adventure. So we're going to be going down in here now. And I'm sad, I'm going to put the choice to And something at the bottom of revenge is... Is they decide not to use it, so of course you can't use boss battles. He was originally meant to be able to control boss battles, but they never finished. Can't leave him here. Don't think I'm needed in here. See you later. Bungo, minion with a mission. Her, 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 her
Ouch, my butt. You cause so much trouble to your mistress, Frank. Right? I don't recall anything on that. Happening. At least we can speak properly. The moon is not now. Your game ends. I kind of acknowledge some video game. Actually, I don't. I don't know if that is an acknowledgement. I just think it's like he said. Oh, oh, oh. There's different phases of Plungo. There's. Invisible Plungo, Giant Plungo, and Fun Plungo, and they're in different- Unfortunately, we got the freaking Invisible Plungos, so... But of course, I don't have to So, my secret to doing this is... They don't make you go any faster. Talent Drop actually makes you go faster. It's so I can hit him. And low full frame rate. Yeah, it looks that way for it. Except you get the boss. Health is in honeycombs if you have to play the first one. Which you should have, because if this is seriously the first time that you're like watching this let's play, watch a let's play of the first game. Yeah. And, and or if you don't if you like just go buy the first game, it's not it's really cheap on Amazon. This game is actually a lot rarer than Yeah, because I checked on Amazon and said there was only one. You asked for it. Why don't you just run off and we'll forget this ever happened? He's like, you're good on you. I do not see last Pokemon. This is why I like Plungo so much. Because he's so loyal to a douchey. Which... Douche Tilda? Nah. Slut Tilda sounds better. Yeah, we were playing on a practice file and you came up with that when you were playing. Slut Tilda? Yeah, Slut Tilda. <laughs> but I was singing weird songs at swim practice today, so. And they're really, they're really cool shadow effects in this game. They're almost as good as Twilight Princess. And here we are in Bimbo Village. I mean Ginger Village. There are a crap load of houses in here, and guess what? They all belong to a certain color of Ginger. There are a lot more colors of Ginjos in here, and if you don't know what a Ginjo is. They're those little guys you collected in the last game. Just so you all know, some glitches are the text sometimes doesn't look right, and there's that little egg thing. Um, yeah, and that usually only happens during beta mode, but I don't think it happens. Oh, which is actually very popular. The black ginger family house. The gray ginger family house. And of course the big ginger family house. Of course the Chinese ginger And he is very racist, which we do not promote on the show. Huh? I'm not racist. You just saw one of those feathers swap colors if you time yourself. See, swap colors. So if you want golden feathers, then get golden feathers by timing yourself. By Which is easy. Okay. I put my trust in you. It's actually easy for player one to kick the crap out of player two's so One time we were playing this, and just turned this mode on for fun, and we were over by a cliff. And he thinks it's funny to run into me and push me off. Yeah. That was at one time he like took his laptop to school on like the last day. And so we, we were, we were playing it in stuff. there. And I was really crappy because I couldn't use a joystick. I had to use the keyboard on his laptop. And it was really shizzy. And here we are in We have a really long cutscene cutting off, so after we got this awesome game, we're gonna cut off folks. We're switching off every World that we play. Once we enter a world, we switch off every episode. Oh, really? Exactly. 
We have terrible voice acting for the characters, and I feel like it. Folks, I think we're gonna cut it off here because we have a ginormous freaking cutscene coming up. So we'll see ya next episode. Next time on Banjo Chili. See ya. <laughs>